Hi everyone, my name is Rahul Kumar and I am part of the Simlink development team. In this video, I am going to show you how you can automatically generate a MATLAB app from a Simlink model. Generating an app allows you to share your model with users that may not be familiar with Simlink and it opens up access for your models. This functionality has been available in the command line since R2020B and now you can access it directly from the Simlink tool strip. Here, I have a model which simulates the vehicle dynamics based on the road suspension interaction. I can create a MATLAB app for this model and expose the parameters such as vehicle mass or suspension stiffness and damping coefficients. These parameters are defined as variables in the model. For example, here are the stiffness and damping coefficients. These are defined in the road suspension interaction block. Using the app, any user can see the impact of changing those parameters on the vehicle dynamics. In order to create the app, I go into the export option under save and choose simulation app. This will bring up a dialog where you can choose a template to create the app from and provide a name for the app. We are going to use the built-in multi-pane simap template for this demo. Click on create to create the app. This will compile the model, identify the parameters and outputs that can be plotted and give you an auto-generated MATLAB app file. Let's wait for this process to complete. Once the app is generated, it is automatically launched. And if you go to the folder location, you will see an ML app file right there. In the app, you will see a screenshot of the model. And the variables that were used in the model along with the default values appear in this table here. Let's just run with the default values for now. And I'll click on the run button to start the simulations. The model outputs the vehicle vertical displacement in millimeters, which can be seen in this plot. For this set of values, the maximum displacement is about 8 millimeters. Let's change the mass of the vehicle and see the effect it has on the vertical displacement. And now you can see that the results have changed slightly and the maximum displacement for, for a heavier vehicle is only about six millimeters. Now, in order to share this app with others who may not have Simlink, we can now deploy this app. So let me close out of this app here and open the app in the app designer. In app designer, you can click on the share drop down button and select the option to create a standalone application. Here, I will add a folder that is required for the app to run this assets folder. And you click on the package to create the standalone application. When the packaging is complete, the folder where the application was saved will open automatically and you can go into the for testing folder to test the application. You can see the executable file here. At this point, you can exit out of MATLAB. You can run this application like any other Windows application by double clicking on it. The application does require the MATLAB compiler runtime, which you can download from the mathworks.com website. I already have the runtime installed, so I can go ahead and run the application.
when the application launches you can run the simulations as we did before as i have shown you it is extremely easy to automatically generate an app for the model and deploy it to share with other users so go ahead and try it out with your own models thank you